So first we need the shape file of the roads. If you don't have, there is a tool that it's follow the uh, open street maps, which is called Quick Open Street Maps plugin. This plugin, you can copy this one, and the name it's Open Street uh, Quick Open Street Maps. So go to the plugin manage and install plugins so you will search for the quick open street maps and then you choose it okay and then download it there is also a new version available but i'm using this the current version 1.14 it's fine for me try to install it Now it will come with the vector here. So the next step is to open the few quick of street maps. Okay, open now. So nothing to do here, just you need to see there is a quick query. And this is the keys, that's mean what kind of uh, a factor you want. And the value is the classes inside this key factor. So, and where you want to search in which village or town or whatever if you like you can write the address here okay and then you search inside this address but a more uh, accurate way to do it is already we have the study area if you see if i can uh, add uh, if we open the open street maps Yes. See, it's rich with the roads. So, if we see that there are heavy network here, that means we are able to download all of these features from this EQ, a quick of street maps. So fair enough. So we will go back. Okay, and then we go to the again to the query. Yes, we will put in, we will not take the round canvas, no, we will take the layer extent. The layer extent, which layer? It's the study area. That's all. So we will run the query. We will ask for all of the features that inside the study area. Run the queries, it will take time. Search for whatever they have inside this query or inside the study area uh, shape file now we start to find uh, points for us lines Multi polygons, too many uh, features. Yes. Now you can close this one. That's all. Also, turn off the bands so that you can see what's inside now. Okay. So we are not interested in the polygons. Also, we are not interested in the points. So you can see the street network now. It's all of the street network, which is the inside. It came as the feature. So one of them, it's not necessary. I think this is the uh, ring roads. Yes, the highway. So now with this one, also remove. Yep. So now you have just uh, the uh, the internal roads and the highways. So you can open. Save this one. So you can open the attribute and you see really we have a rich uh, data set almost uh, 16,000, uh, 17,000 uh, class. We don't like to use all of it because some of the roads maybe is not necessary. So if you like, you can just choose uh, 
uh, within the highway what kind of features you are looking for for example i i want to select specific road type so i will show you how to this is i put the screenshot here so you will go to uh, select which is here select using expression and you want to select from the highway so you can you can check now what kind of features you have you have service you have residential uh, you have primary roads you have uh, better trains foot, footway some features empty so you check and see what kind of roads you want you are looking for usually it's the main roads inside the city so go for select and based on what you have just take this piece of code you will choose something from the the highway this is the highway if you can go to the field and take the name highway put it between brackets equal primary so i want the primary which is also written here within the uh, uh, the uh, classes we have primary roads you can see here we have the primary also i need the road and the secondary so you use the logic primary or road or secondary so select feature now select features yeah we have 527 feature selected so what you can do here you can see all this dark yellow it's selected as the roads so what you can do you can just try to click and export save feature save selected feature as you can save it as shape file just reshape file and if you have whatever you have the uh, where is your file you want to save it so you will save this uh, feature into desktop for example this is the roads the road network save selected only let's follow the uh, the file name I took the name so we will just put the name as roads road network okay and it's created here so we can turn off this one yes now we have the main roads of the city so as you know we can proceed with the roads now and it's the shape file secondary and the primary and road now we should convert this one into raster using the distance from roads okay which is the euclidean distance unfortunately here in the qgis we don't have this function we don't have the distance from or the euclidean distance that's why i already converted this in arcgis okay so this is the problem here so i convert it in the arcgis and it's become as raster just follow the euclidean distance using this uh, uh, shape file is the road network so i will i already obtain it using the other software so the uh, distance from roads distance to roads i just want to yeah so this one it's the distance to roads so this is the way how to download the roads using the quick uh, uh, quick 
uh, OSM, Quick Open Street Maps, and then you can take it as distance uh, two roads using the Euclidean distance and create your uh, distance to road uh, factor or map. Okay, fair enough. So now we have most of the data. Now we have all the layers. This one not needed anymore. Let's delete this one. Okay. Actually, in case if you want to uh, clip a boundary here, you know this is uh, it's available with the clip. So you can clip the steady area, and you can clip the the road networks using the steady area focus that's all I clipped not needed so this is your network okay. just we clipped it if you want more roads try to increase the uh, uh, logic here adding secondary track or whatever and you can get a very clean uh, road maps okay so this is not needed anymore so this is done now it's become shape file and we took it to uh, rgis and we created the uh, distance uh, the euclidean distance 